Creeper. Always pretty inside Pioneer Square this time of the year. At the mall now. I actually just came in because I had to use the restroom. But I'm also noticing they're doing a little Santa meet and greet down there as well. That's the hipster Santa. Looks like he's chilling out there with this Santa man bun. <laughs> yeah, I came in to use the restroom, but couldn't find it. Maybe we'll have some better luck down here. Yep, they got it set up nice. You gotta make a reservation. Hey, it's Hipster Santa. Good to see you, brother. Hello. What's the official name? That's what I thought. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Good to see you, bro. This always looks pretty, too, with the fountains and all the poinsettias going. Very pretty. And they got a couple of the trees here as well. But yeah, very nice. Here's some more info too. You can get photos with Santa or Hipster Santa like we just saw. And also I noticed something on the way in. I'm going to go take a peek at here in just two seconds. So check this out. We just passed where the Myron Frank building was. We actually did a full vlog not too long ago on the Santa Land that was held at the Myron Frank right here in downtown Portland. This is actually the monorail that was up top for many years. This was once mounted to the ceiling and carried children through the iconic Santa Land. The monorail was first installed in 1959 and operated until 2005. But yeah, this is the official one. This was all put away at the Oregon Historical Society. But look at that, you would have sat right in there and you would have run around the top of the mall they would have had it like kind of mounted to the ceiling not here but at Meyer and Frank downtown Portland pretty darn cool to see an old relic of the past I dig it yep that is pretty cool love it monorail 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 reminds me of the Simpsons Always looks pretty through here. Oh, that's fresh. Is it gonna snow here soon? It's supposed to snow at one. That's oh, oh, crazy! I know. I heard you say it. I was like, that'd be. Oh, I hear. Oh, you were right, bro. Good timing. This guy was on point, dude. Dude, he knew. He was like, it's gonna snow, bro. Check that out. It's snowing, you guys. Well, it's like a snow. It's like a so snow. It's like foam. It's like a foam. That's cool, though. Heck yeah. Good timing. That is neat. <laughs> the snow. I won't film it if you don't want to be on it, but I was gonna. Oh, it's cool. Yeah, this is cool. Look at this. I was like, we went to, uh, I was just at White Center and they said it was gonna snow there and it didn't. And I was like, what's up with that? Yeah. They ain't messing around. This is cool as heck. Oh, wow. Maybe Probably a couple. That is pretty. I'm gonna head back down and go stand in it. <laughs> that is pretty. I'm glad I, I'm glad I heard what you said. I almost just walked out without, that's neat. Heck yeah. Look at that, you guys. It's really coming down now. We about to get we about to get covered. <laughs> this is neat. Heck yeah. It's all sticking to the lights and everything. <laughs> yeah, I think they call it snow. It's like a snow snow soap or something. Yeah. Maybe it's just foam. Cool, At first, a couple days ago, it was an actual like water particles. Oh it wow! Like actual snow. Everybody's down there checking it out. Too. It didn't look as pretty as this. Oh, so pretty, especially with all the lights and everything up top. That is neat. Good timing. 
Hey, happy holidays to you, bro. I feel bad for the custodians. Right? They're just standing here and they're just like, all right, all right, all right. They brought a tear to my eye, not because I like it, it's because of the soap. No. <laughs> all right, Take care, guys. Got the lights all decked out. The trees. Or the trees all decked out with the lights, I should say. And yes, that's a leaf blower. Yes, that is a leaf blower. And yes, right in front of us there is the big tree. All lit up beautifully. Let's go take a closer peek. We saw it last week. But it is gorgeous. Here is the actual Meyer and Frank building itself. And not to mention the little monorail that we saw, but they actually have another piece of it here on display. The Meyer and Frank Santa Land monorail for over 50 seasons, the London Soundtrack monorail gave thousands and delighted children's a sleigh eye view of Santa Land and Meyer and Frank down sound. Built in Fairview, Idaho, the monorail is thought to be the one existing from the original 26. And just like the other signs say, its final journey was on December 24th, Christmas Eve, of 2005 but there you have it another piece of the historic monorail right here at the Myron Frank which a lot of folks probably remember coming here during the holidays and seeing the Santa Land exhibit which was very very popular and the monorail would kind of hover above the department store kind of around the top roof part but yeah they've done a great job of bringing this back i know it was at the oregon historical society kind of hidden away but yeah that is pretty neat to see all these years later and it looks like they have a ton of activities planned here too the tree lighting ceremony already happened but they have a lot of holiday bazaars and tuba christmas is coming up so definitely the hot spot for the holidays right here at pioneer square absolutely gorgeous you can get a shot of the old Meyer and Frank there behind us. But yeah, this whole area is definitely very traditional when it comes to the holidays and Portland. Beautiful. gonna do it for today if you guys are new here make sure you hit that red subscribe button that'll dial you into being a creeper you can also ring that bell down below that way when i creep you guys will be the first to creep and if you did enjoy this particular episode make sure you give it a thumbs up i do appreciate you guys for always tuning in and creeping with till next time creeper out for now